navy seal rearing and thereof and Badleton takes up the leading and left behind was Bulawayo who's about 15 lengths from the leader Basilton. Basilton followed by Navy Seal. These two have a lead of about eight lengths ahead of Seton Sands. Bulawayo being asked by Henley Root to join the rest and detached is Storm Away. They head past the cemetery bend. Basilton a length ahead of Navy Seal. A further 10, 15 lengths comes Bulawayo. A lap two, three lengths behind Bulawayo comes Satan Sons and Storm Away is stone last. As they come to face the judge, it's Basilton, Navy Seal, looming large on the outside now and being asked by Kibet to challenge Basilton. Basilton holding on the inside. Navy Seal storming through the middle and he's now putting on an extra gear here. It's going to be smooth sailing for Navy Seal. Basilton cannot catch up. Navy Seal is careering away here. Navy Seal will justify favoritism with ease as it seems. Navy Seal goes home. Kibet eases. Basilton in second. Bulawayo in third. Fifth is Storm Away and a very, very weary looking Seton Sands stone last. Navy Seal wins. Ladies and gentlemen, I have the winning connections of the first race, the Nyayo Stadium, terms for the Nakuru Champions stake. First, we have winning jockey, Richard Kibet. Kibet, last time, Navy Seal won very easily. Today again, you just track the leader and 400 out, you ask your horse to go and there was no stopping. How was it? Yes, I must say, this was a really nice horse. When I jump, I try to settle him, and he, he settled very nicely. When he hit 600 meters, he was having uh, more trouble because of the pace was slowing down. I wait and deal straight. When I pull it out, he tried very nicely, and he won very well. I must say thank you to the trainer and all the connection on this horse. Thanks a lot. Congratulations on that. And the trainer of Navy Seal, Dr. Patsy Sakum. Um, Never Seal seems like he began his career slowly, but the last two wins have been just pure class. How is he working with in the stable? He's a, a very easy horse to work with, full of life. Um, this distance sits him better than the sprint because he's got great long legs. Um, really, he needs a trip now, but uh, you know, we're going to go. Probably for the Alabin Salem at the end of the season, see if we can win that, and then there won't be much for him until the Guineas trial. But he's a classic horse, and this is hope. This is the way we're going to go with him. So we hope that he will, you know, become perhaps a classic winner. Which is well, classic he looks, and we hope that he will be. And I can see you here. So I will ask Anna. Your thoughts on that? Well, it's a brilliant horse and a brilliant race. That's all I can say. <laughs> and we have presentation of the Nakur Champion Stakes, the winning connections of Navy Seal, being proudly presented by Julius, who's an assistant director with Sport Kenya, who have generously sponsored today's race. So, Julius, please present the trophy to one of the geriatric owners of Navy Seal. Makofi Tafadali. And there's also a goodie bag to go for the owner. Will be presented together with Dr. 
John Sacom, the director of Jockey Club, to the winning owner again by Julius. Thank you very much. And the winning jockey as well, Richard Kibet. There is a goodie bag from Sports Kenya. And again, Julius will be doing the honors. Tafadali Makofi. And receiving the trophy, or rather the goodie bag, in on behalf of the trainer is Leslie Sakom, on behalf of her mom and trainer. Makofi Tafadali. Thank you very much, Sports Kenya, and congratulations to the winning connection.